I'm Paul Jensen, and um, I'm going to start uh, training one of the pups um, that I have here today. Uh, he's nine weeks old, and um, to prepare for it, I'm going to just take the ramps of this training table and put them down. And this is a, a method that a lot of people use. Um, it saves our back. We don't have to lean over and hold on to the, um, the dog. It's nice to get the dog up uh, in, in this level here. But before I start, um, you see it's a little bit of sunshine today. I have my sunglasses on and you have to remove them because you want to be able to dog to see you. So always, whenever you train a dog, take your sunglasses off. And uh, I will now go and uh, get the pup. Come, yeah, come. Mm -hmm. What's this? Have to uh, start introducing the dog to the table. And this is all new, so we don't want to fight with him. We just want to direct him. Come on, yeah, come. Come on, come on. Oh, see, see, not always do they want to go up, but so you direct him. Come on, come on. Oh, yeah, it's tough, it's tough. Come on, hey, it wasn't so bad, it wasn't so bad. See, hey, here we go. Hey, it wasn't so bad. Just come on, come on, then we'll do it again. Let's see if you recognize it when you got from this end here. Come on. Hi, come. 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 See? Come on. Come on. No, no. Come on. See? Oh, yeah. Come on. Come on. It was good. Oh, it was good. Yeah. Come. Come. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Come on. We're just going to do this a little, a little bit. Yeah. Come on. Oh, come on. See? Come. Come. Oh, that was good. Hey, see the tail is going. Oh, you love it now. It wasn't so bad. So what we have to do is just keep on exposing the dog without too much pressure. And uh, eventually he's going to go up there and uh, not have such a big problem with it. Come on. See, hey, hey, see, see, now we go up there. There's no pull and we go down. Come on. See, come. Hey. No, 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 you have been there, yeah. Whoa, come. So I just stopped the dog just for a little second up there and then uh, make him think about what it is that he's doing. Come on, yeah, come. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come. Yeah. Whoa, come. See, when I'm, when I'm stopping the dog with a woe, I only do it for a very short period of time. And I use my body, my voice, and the lead to hold the dog back so that later I can intermix the, the different commands. But it's very short. Come on, come. Yeah, see, now he came all by, and I said, whoa. Come, good boy. He doesn't even know why I'm stopping him, so his legs stop, stand still. And after a little while, we can extend. Oh, do you want to go up this way? Oh, that's good. Come on, good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah, come on, good boy. And come. Come. Whoa. Come, good boy. One of the things that uh, you always should do when you're working with a dog is when you go forward, always use, and you want a dog to follow you, use the leg that's closest to the dog. So if you want to move forward, use your left foot to go forward. Come. 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 <laughs> Good boy. Yeah, you're coming, good boy. Come. Hey, you're doing great. You're becoming a champ. Yeah, come. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Come. Good boy. 
So he doesn't really know why he's asked to stop up there, but this is the beginning of the control that you want for any pointing dog. You want to be able to control the dog and it's going to stay there for a while. So these are the beginning steps that you should use. Come. Whoa. Come. Good boy. At least what you're seeing now, he's getting used to the table. It's not anything to be afraid of. And he's enjoying. Yeah, see. Whoa. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. Good boy. Come. Yep. Good boy. You are doing great. Yes, you are doing great. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Whoa. Come. Good boy. So after a couple of weeks as he grows up and a repeat of this is going to make sure that he is going to do exactly fine and, and be able to stand there for a long period of time. And I guess by now he's a little tired, so he's... <laughs> Dylan and I hope you enjoyed this episode of Bird Dogs Afield. Friends, this is your complete video magazine on upland bird hunting and pointing dogs. Check back frequently on MyOutdoorTV.com for future programming. Also, you'll find additional information on our website, BirdDogsAfield.com. Friends, also support our sponsors. They help make this possible. Dylan and I hope to meet you in the field someday. Until then, good hunting, hunt safely. Bird Dogs Afield, presented by Native Performance Dog Food and brought to you in part by Irish Setter Legendary Boots, RST Shot Shells, Mud River Dog Products, and On Point Kennel.